Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Crimson here bringing you guys a brand new video of what you guys are watching today. Some Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay for you guys here today. Sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. I'm going to try uploading again once this Call of Duty comes out. I know my last video I said I was going to upload when uh, League Play came out. But League Play was just absolutely horse meat on Black Ops 4. I did not like it one bit. So, yeah, my bad for that. But... Without further ado, let's get into this video. Today, we're just going to be talking about... I'm going to make it a super quick video. We're just going to be talking about my first impressions on Call of Duty Modern Warfare. If you guys have didn't know this game, uh, this game mode, or the little alpha alpha thing got released on a Thursday. We were supposed to expect, expect it on a Friday, but it got released on a Thursday, and this new map came out on a Friday. So what you guys are watching here is some gameplay from Friday. This video is going to be going up on a Saturday, but whatever. Let's get right into the video. There's not too many uh, first impressions I have on it because this is literally probably like the little glimpse we got of this game first and foremost is the one things i do like is one the l3 sprinting which makes you sprint faster that is super dope because like obviously you could get to places faster it's, it's just super amazing the way they implement in that second is the little shoulder peeking around the wall it's um it's super neat to have it because like you could just sprint to a wall and then just boom like shoulder peek it and like you could just get a first blend and stuff like that so that's super cool those are the two things i like about this game so far is the the shoulder peeking and the l3 sprinting one thing that i don't i'm not too big of a fan is the sliding i know some friends said that the sliding is super smooth um maybe it was my controller i'm not sure but for me when i slide it's super inconsistent my character will slide sometimes and then when i do want it to slide like let's i'm in a gunfight and i'm trying to slide away quickly my character will not slide and it'll like slide so slow and it'll just crouch immediately or it'll or instead of instead of sliding it'll just crouch like i'll be trying to get in the gunfight and then boom like they're chasing me and i try sliding my character just crouches i don't like i said i don't know if it's my controller if the settings because i did try this with both settings if you guys don't know there's a setting on the ps4 or on the game where you could choose between holding circle to slide or just tapping it i have it on just tapping it because i find when i when i uh hold it to slide it's when this like little bug seems to like uh happen the most when i click circle i guess it just renders it super quickly and it'll just slide but the other thing um is that we i uh, me personally i have to get used to kind of aiming in or doing another action to stop the sliding because i've heard that apparently now on this game you can't cancel your slide by clicking circle so that's going to be something new that I'm going to have to get used to. I don't know if you guys are going to get used to it or you guys didn't do that before. Because I know in previous cards you could cancel your slide by zooming in or something like that. I know in BO4 you could. But normally I was used to canceling my slide just by clicking the button again that I was uh, that I used to slide the first time. So that's going to get some getting used to. Um, other than that, the game plays out really well. Uh, it's super smooth. The guns, I love them. Some guns, obviously. There's a pistol in here. I don't know the name of it, but it's a brown pistol. That pistol needs to get buffed ASAP. It is probably the weakest pistol i played with in any beta literally the weakest pistol i'm pretty sure you guys can agree with me too if you guys have played the game it takes a ridiculous amount of bullets to kill someone and it shouldn't be that way you know it's a pistol obviously it's supposed to be a little weaker than uh most guns but still it's ridiculous the amount of ammo you have to waste on someone later on in the video you guys will see what i'm talking about um but yeah, like I was saying, other than like those little small features, we didn't, we don't really get to see the full extension of the game because, like I said, I'm 100% sure that what we're playing with right now is just the raw gun, no attachments, no perks, no nothing. It's just straight up a gun, no perks, no nothing, no attachments. So I still can't put my two cents on how the gunplay feels or how the guns feel in general because obviously when you have different attachments on a gun it'll make the gun uh you know the, the mechanics of the gun be a little bit different so like i said i can't really full give my my two cents on that but um as of the the way the game is right now it has some potential i'm not gonna lie the cool thing is that it's this card is gonna be more of a i would say a little passive game and you could just you know kind of um kind of outplay your opponents in a way i'm talking competitively wise because that's if you guys know my channel that's what i tend to upload i'm kind of a little competitive player i don't really play pubs as much but um but yeah so like the flow the, the flow and the dynamic of the game feels just fine uh hopefully they don't they don't change like anything too major when the full game comes out maybe they tweak things not from here and there but uh like I said, hopefully they don't change too much because if they do, it's going to feel like the beta is just a whole complete different game than what the actual game is going to be. And it's just going to make the COD community completely outrageous. You know how it is. They they get mad for any little thing. But um, but yeah, I think that was the end of the video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Don't forget to drop, drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm trying to reach 300 by the end of the year. So uh, yeah, 
don't forget to drop a like comment and subscribe tell me what you guys thought about this video and tell me what guns you guys think need to be buffed but as of today that is it guys it's your boy cream and i'm out